Hi, for anyone new to the channel, I'm Troy. Today's video is the first of some shorter videos that we're going to make this year. Our GeoPro camper behind us is three years old, and so we know small repairs are coming our way. As they do, we will make short videos showing you how we fix these problems and where we source the materials. Hopefully, these will save you, our viewers, some time and money. We are calling these videos the Two Minute Fix, and we will eventually put them in their own playlist on the channel. And now, let's get to today's two minute fix. So anyone with a camper knows one thing to be true. Repairs are always needed. When we were out west recently, the door to our sewer tube carrier broke. As it is plastic, this will likely happen to all of them sooner or later. And while it's not a big deal, we thought we'd show you how we solved it so maybe you could order the parts ahead of time and have one on hand just in case. So the part that failed was a little plastic hinge on the door. It broke off. Luckily the camper was parked and we didn't lose the sewer hose. That was very convenient. But we did have to travel home 2,000 miles with a broken sewer door. Remember in the earlier videos where we talked about having waterproof tape or some very, very strong duct tape? This is a classic reason why. These sewer um, holders are accessible on both sides. So if one door breaks, you simply can seal it up and access it from the other side. One of the best features of the super tube is that it holds my sewer hose and the elbow in one place. So I don't have to store any of these products in the front pass through. So Linda went on the hunt and she was able to find us just the door, easy fix. So to find the part, went online to the company that's listed on the front here and went to their website where it listed a few different places that we could find the replacement door. Now, there are two options. You can buy the door on the mounting bracket itself, and that one is more readily available um, across the internet, but in reading some reviews, we found two problems. One is if we replace the mounting bracket, it's likely glued on, so we would have had to cut that tube and then our elbow wouldn't have fit. Um, some people have uh, just pulled the door off of that mounting bracket and put it on the one that's on their camper, but we also read that some people broke the hinge again while they tried that. So we really just wanted the door only. So according to the website, there were three places that would sell it, Rec Pro, Valterra, and Babs RV. Now I went online and looked at Rec Pro and Valterra and actually called Rec Pro. They do just only sell it with the mounting bracket, so Babs RV was the winner. Um, we got two of them for about $23, and that was priority shipped. Um, within 30 minutes of ordering, I already had a tracking link, so um, great experience. Now, since then, I have found on eBay where you can buy one door only um, for about $11, but we figure if it broke one time, it's probably gonna break again, so we're gonna keep the spare. So the quickest part of this video is actually snapping the new door in. So this is really simple. Take this top post, run it up into that hole with your finger, pop it in on the bottom, and then lock it down. Now, to be on the safe side, I follow up with a little carabiner as a backup. And we have a spare now. So if we have this problem again on the road, I don't have to worry about losing the hose going down the highway. This is a two minute fix on the outside. So there you have it. A short video about a really simple fix. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. We'll catch you next time. Have a great week.